Hey guys, how's it going? This is Blakeu92 here again with another tutorial, but this one's going to be over the Avid Title Tool. That's right, the Basic Title Tool. Last time uh, in my other tutorials, there were three of them, we went over the Avid Marquee Title Tool, which is kind of an advanced form of the original title tool that was always and has been with the... Uh, original Avid Media Composer so the title tool is a little bit simpler and uh, it still allows you to make great titles and you know change the everything like as uh, much as you want with the color and and the fonts and everything but it may not have the capabilities of 3D or uh, you know special animations that Marquee Title can do because it kind of resembles After Effects in some ways. Okay in this first part um, of the title tool is going to be kind of basic. We're just going to be going over uh, a lot of the menus and drop down boxes and you know different options for fonts and stuff like that. But in the second one, we'll learn uh, a little bit more technique behind the uh, drop shadows and how to save your titles and what is actually happening when you create a title. Now, just because this is an easier title tool doesn't mean you can't go ahead and go learn the Avid Marquee title tool because it is required now for the Avid Certified User exam. You have to know how to use it a little bit and know some of the functionality of the Marquee tool. But for your general uh, title needs, this will do the trick. And I highly recommend watching my other video. If you haven't seen any of my other videos, I always uh, like to say that I'm a Final Cut Pro Certified User and an Avid Media Composer certified user, but that doesn't mean I'm an instructor or a certified instructor in either of those. I'm